Hello everyone. Uh, I'm making this video as a special thank you to Dr. Sutton and the MDI prep team. I got my MCAT score back a week ago and I got a 509. Uh, so I'm really excited about that. Um, it's actually a 10 point increase from my previous exam. Um, so I want to talk a little bit about my background and um, my journey as a pre-med student. Um, so I actually graduated from Baylor in 2018, so about six years ago. I took my first MCAT in 2017. Um, full disclosure, I took it four times, so I really struggled with this exam, um, and Dr. Sutton and the MDI prep team really helped me. Um, so again, I took it in 2017, so my junior year, um, the first score I got back was a 498, so not good enough. Um, I felt like I was not competitive enough to apply, so I did not apply uh, for that cycle. So I then went and got a master's degree in biochemistry and retook the exam in 2022. Um, in that exam, I got a 503, so a little bit of a jump. Um, I saw that jump a lot in my, um, in my biochemistry score, given I had taken a biochemistry master's. Um, but I applied and didn't receive any interviews. Um, I also applied a little late, so I'm sure that played a huge factor. Um, so didn't get any interviews. Um, I went again and took the MCAT because I didn't feel like a 503 was good enough. Uh, I took it again in 2023, and I got a 499, so actually worse than my 503. Um, that being said, I was very discouraged. I did not apply that cycle, and I realized that um, whatever I was doing to study for the MCAT, it wasn't good enough. Uh, so I needed to find help. I needed to find somebody to you know, guide me, figure out what I'm doing incorrectly, how I'm studying incorrectly, uh, and try to make some changes to get a better score. Um, so I actually had a family friend who went through the MDI prep uh, course and um, she referred me to Dr. Sutton and uh, thank God she did. Um, so I started with Dr. Sutton, I believe a little bit after the summer of 2023. Um, and I want to talk a little bit about how, you know, his program really helped me with the MCAT. So previously I had taken a couple Kaplan courses. Um, and I also use a lot of UWorld. And these websites, I think, were very, very good for content. Um, but for some reason, I just wasn't able to apply that content on my exams. Um, so I was really st struggling with the application portion of the MCAT and the critical thinking portion and how to approach questions. I didn't realize until I got with Dr. Sutton that there is so much more to taking this test than just content. Um, and so these test strategies are what really, really gave me that 10 point jump from the 499 to a 509. Um, but specifically, I wanna talk a little bit about the program and kind of what, what really helped me. Um, so again, I graduated you know, my undergrad in 2018, so six years ago. That means that I took classes like general chemistry and physics you know, more than six years ago. I took it in 2015, 2016. So that'd be almost nine years ago. Um, that being said, you know, some of the content was kind of, you know, unfamiliar just because it had been so long since I'd seen it, since I touched it. Um, so with MDI Prep, we actually use Blueprint to, to um, reinforce all of the content. And I really love the way Blueprint taught it. I love the calendar that they made. Um, when you first get into Blueprint, you know, they, they set a schedule for you. It's something that, you know, Kaplan never did for me. It's really difficult to keep track of a schedule, uh, as well as, you know, do things like, you know, part-time work or any other leisure activities that you might do or be interested in, um, without that schedule. So even if you get behind, even if you, you know, you know, miss a day or two, you can actually reset that schedule and they'll, they'll make a whole new one for you, like super quick, it was so easy. Um, and I really love the videos, the way that they break things down and give you quizzes in between them to really reinforce the material. Um, and they also keep you know showing you that material over and over again in the uh, blueprint practice tests. Um, so that really helped me with content. Um, I know I studied a lot of content for the last couple of years just because I took the exam so many times but um, the way that they laid it out and how concise it was, um, it really helped me get all the high yield stuff very quickly. 
Um, that being said, I was still scoring in the low 500s. Um, and that's because I just wasn't taking the test correctly. And that's something that Dr. Sutton really helped me with, um, especially, you know, in our small group, you know, tutor sessions. He really gets, you know, one-on-one -on -one with you to try to figure out, um, you know, how you're approaching this question incorrectly. Uh, he gives you huge, huge pointers on, on how to approach it. Even if you don't know the content, you can still get the question right, which is kind of amazing. Um, so it was these, it was these tests strategies that I just was not getting from any other, any other company. Um, so I want to take, I want to thank, take the time to thank Dr. Sutton and the MBA prep team for really helping me out. I think with a 509, you know, I should be able to get into somewhere. Um, so thank you so much. You guys were such a huge help in my journey to get into medical school.